Game of the Day today is the Lego Harry Potter games, and I'm gonna bundle years one through four and five through seven all into one video. I love Lego games. I haven't played nearly as many of them as I would have liked to, but now that I'm streaming, there is an excuse to kind of fit into my schedule, and they are just so adorably fun to play. I loved Legos as a kid. I still love them today. I love that these Lego games have this kind of quirky take on these stories that I've seen over and over and over again. Going back through all of those movies in Lego form and kind of seeing the way that those pivotal iconic scenes have been translated translated into these Legofied versions was just really, really fun. Magic fits really well with the staples of Lego games. Like if you build stuff, you just do it with your wand. In other Lego games, it's kind of like stacked together really quick, but it is cool to kind of be like, no, there's context in this one. In the way that they incorporate the different types of magical abilities and how they impact the world and how you use them to puzzle solve and navigate and in combat and stuff is really fun. Years five through seven do add new and interesting things. They have more dynamic 3D sequences. Uh, they have this dual mechanic and stuff and so I like that they continue to add things in that second installment of the Lego Harry Potter package. Going back to older Lego games like this it's a little weird not to have the voice acting but it did force them to be creative and how they express certain things without being able to use words. It almost felt like I was watching a silent film but the video game version of it. As of every Lego game there is an absurd amount of content and I definitely didn't do everything but that's the nice thing about the Lego games is you can kind of get as much as you need out of them. I just played through the main campaigns of all seven or eight titles and it still took me like 30 some hours to get through all of it so <laughs> I imagine there is like up to 100 hours of content if I wanted to go out and do everything which I'm not going to do but I quite enjoyed my time with it and that's why the Lego Harry Potter games are today's game of the day.